what's going on guys welcome back to another one of my videos haven't posted in a while i was it's like a big break from cards sold everything and then i took like a three month break and now i'm back into it and i'm doing it right this time i used to be buying a lot of like cheap walmart boxes and stuff and now i'm buying off whatnot and ebay and stuff like that so let's get into it i'm gonna be showing you my new collection that i've started back up so let's go okay so start off ryan Tannehill, psa 9 rookie pick this off up off of whatnot for five bucks cheap slab so just went ahead and picked it up okay then we have a saquon barkley rated rookie back at eight um i don't i picked this up at a card shop i think i picked it up for 15 bucks somewhere around there slide that back in there okay Got a JJ Watt rookie, SGC 10. Picked this up at card shop for 40 bucks. Love JJ Watt. Sad he's retiring, but can't play forever. Put that back. Alright. To a rookie, um, PSA 9. Pick this up off of whatnot for 15 bucks. Cheaper slab to a, so figured why not pick it up. And this Richard or Paul Richardson, haven't really heard a lot of them. It's a rookie, but um, I'm a Seahawks fan. Don't really know who he is, but Seahawks player. So I didn't really care, and I got it for like five bucks at a card shop. So. Back at 9.5. And it's also it's numbered out of 50. I don't know if you can see that in the top corner, top right corner. There it is. Okay, moving on to the one touch cards. So, this Ernie Banks. I've actually had this for a while. It was my grandpa's card. So, it wasn't like one of the old like slab type things here let's see if i can find it um yeah here it is it was in one of these like old like things i can't even get it apart i don't know it was like super like weird but I just took it out and put it in a one touch or mag, whatever you want to call it. Alright, and then Jerry Rice Rookie found this in my dad's collection. He has a ton of cards out in our garage. So I was digging through it and I found this. It's pretty nice, but it's in pretty bad condition. So not worth a lot. Okay. And Steve Largent Auto, I think you've seen this before on my channel, did not sell it because he, Steve Largent signed it personally for me, so it's pretty special to me. A few cards trying to come up. Okay, there we go. Alright, All right, then we have a Emmanuel... Mudea or Mudea, not quite sure how to pronounce this name. Six out of forty-nine RPA. Not the greatest auto in the world. We'll say that. It is. Where is it? A player-worn material, so not the worst. But I actually got this in a um, pull box off whatnot. 
So, I mean, for like five bucks entry, definitely not bad. All right, and then got a Justin Herbert Luminance, Luminance patch out of 49. And it is player worn slash used. Pick this up at my local card shop for like 15, 20 bucks. So definitely not mad about that. So 2022, third year. All right, and then here is a Marshawn Lynch rookie. Number two, 249. Again, Seahawks fan, so pretty cool. Love Steve Largent. Or not Steve Largent, love Marshawn Lynch. Sorry. He played whenever I was younger, but I still remember him and all the Madden games and stuff. I used to play those all the time. Sammy Sosa, double autograph. I've also showed you guys this one on my channel before. Sammy Sosa signed it for my dad, and the marker was, like, dried up. He's out in the cold, so signed it twice. Sounds pretty cool. Kept that one whenever I sold everything. Then a mini John Morant rookie. I won, um, won this one in the pool box with the um, RPA up there. So again, definitely not mad about that. All right, and then moving on to the like top loaded cards. Um, got a Chris Olave patch numbered to twenty five. Got that in the um. Got that. Got this in a in the pool box. It was a rookie's pool box, and I got this. It was one of the chasers, and that's also whenever I pulled that Lynch up there. was in that pool box, so pretty nice. And then start off here with all these. All right, and we got a Russ patch. Player worn, not numbered. And Russ left Seahawks, not a huge fan of him anymore. Not having the greatest years, I can definitely say that. One of his worst. But still, he's in a Seahawks uniform, so. Next, we got a Devontae Smith, optic rated rookie. Picked this up at a card shop for like eight bucks. Or is that, it was four bucks actually. And I was hoping you'd raise in value a little bit after the Super Bowl, but with low end cards, doesn't really do a whole lot. Okay, so then, so this one's interesting. It's a gold Michael Westbrook. It's 1995, and that's eight or 16 of 18. So, don't know if that's like the old way they numbered them, but. Pretty cool. Got this in the um, same pool box as the Lynch and the Chris Olave. So that's nice. Uh, Chris Carson Red score. Seahawks fan, also OSU fan. Chris Carson went to OSU and he's on the Seahawks, so pretty nice. Really like this card. I think I got that in a pool box as well. Zion McCollum out of 199 rookie from XR. Uh, I think I, I also got this in the same uh, rookie pool box as the other two. Got some good cards from that. And then got a Kenny Pickett rookie select. And this is Concourse, so definitely not the best. But can you pick a rookie nonetheless? Got that for six bucks at a card shop, so. And then Trey Lance, rookie. Got this uh, in a lot, I think, on um, 
and whatnot. Not numbered or anything, but Trey Lance. No, he's definitely not the um, 49ers quarterback you're looking for anymore because we got Brock Purdy. But still uh, the rookie QB. So then we got Anthony Davis. Don't know. What is this parallel called? If you know, comment below. I think it's like the. It's definitely. It's, I don't know. It's like a star or something. Anthony Davis. Mosaic. Pretty nice. Moving on. Uh, Dwayne Eskridge rookie select. Pretty nice. Premier level. So, you know, we're getting better. Getting up there. Alright, and then we got a Trey Man. Trey Man rookie patch. Thunder fan. So, pretty nice. Out of 199. Yep. Pick this up at a card, local card shop for like $4. So, definitely not bad. And then we got a Jack Flirty, or Flaherty. I don't know, out of 99, a friend gave this to me back whenever I was starting up cards again because I didn't really have a ton, so he gave it to me. Purple Optic. Yeah, JJ Watt. Like I said earlier, I really like JJ Watt. Dominant player out of 149. Yep. Pick this up off of whatnot for like three dollars. Um. All right, LeBron James. T minus. Not numbered. It's a little insert. Pick this up in like a three card lot for like two dollars or something, off whatnot. So. Like that. Got a lot more. To go through. Justin Fields, rookie. Out of Flux. Picked this up whenever I was just getting back into it from a Walmart pack. Got Kyle Trask, rookie. Picked this up in that um, rookie pool box I was talking about earlier. DK Metcalf, Prestige. Love DK. One of my favorite players in the league, probably top three. Not numbered, but nice insert, and I have more of DK and Lockett coming in. So, it's nice. Josh Goody, rookie, out of, um, out of Illusions. Again, like the Thunder, Josh Goody's pretty good. So, don't watch a ton of bas basketball, but I know a good amount about it so I still like to collect it uh, Steph Curry winter stays got this out of one of these um, got it out of one of the like mystery tins from Walmart with the two optic packs in it not numbered or anything but nice little Insert got LeBron in the background. Devonte Smith rookie Chronicles. He got this in a little Walmart pack. So, uh, Trey Lance rookie got this in a wild card like little blaster. Got it in a, my uh, stocking from my grandparents. So thank you to them. And then, last but not least, Jerry Judy rookie. Not the uh, not the greatest card, but I got it. I think I got it for free on whatnot or something. Some someone just threw it in there with my order. So there's that. It's actually not the last one. I still got like eight more or so. Keen, not gonna pronounce his last name. Red and green rated rookie 
out of optic, got it off of whatnot for out of like a little pull box. Michael Carter rookie. Again, got it off of whatnot a little pull box. Gonna start kind of running through these. I've been taking up a lot of your time. Kayshawn Johnson, four forty nine. Got it off of whatnot with like ninety five percent of these cards. I got off whatnot. Theo Maladin or Melodin, rookie, court side. Again, Thunder fan. So uh, then we got a DK Metcalf, like Shimmer or Starburst or whatever it's called. And then a rookie Michael Carter. We got like four more cards for this. Got a Brady Quinn rookie on the top screen. Don't know what year this is. 2007. Don't know who it is. Definitely not Baker. I don't know, Baker's kind of trash, but. Remote Dubs, got this in a little pool box or something. A little sage, and then finally, Dwayne Wade Pink USA from Mosaic. I got that in the pool box as well. And then, last little pile we got is my um vintage this is all stuff that i pulled out of my dad's collection so all right we got michael jordan superman pretty cool card not worth anything but i really like it bo jackson um air so it's actually it's right Right after ink, Let's see if I can see it. Right after ink, there's supposed to be a little dot, and there's not on mine. Don't know how much those go for, but I have a couple of them. Got an American flag card from Score. These actually do pretty well. They're like a hundred bucks in a PSA ten, and mine's actually in really good condition. So probably gonna send it off to get graded, but. Cool. And then make a mantle reprint. Wish it was the real deal. It's not still a Mickey Mantle. It's in a it was a, a little checklist thing. Barely even fits in the top loader. It's a like longer card. This one's actually one of my favorites. It's a little like Looney Tunes refractor. Nothing on the back, but I really, really like this one. And then we got another Bo Jackson. This one also has the same error as that other one. So no dot behind the ink. And then this one, definitely not worth anything. Still kind of cool. So this is a... Um, this is a Jackie Robertson card. It was my grandpa's, and he cut it in half. As you can see there, it's half a card, and he cut it in half. It'd be worth a good amount if it wasn't cut in half, but you know, don't think that's going to grade well. And then one last little thing. Got these this little like Sports Illustrated binder, and it has the um, the Tony Hawk rookie in it. Haven't cut it yet. Cut one. I popped one out. It was a Reggie Miller, but I have a there's like a ton of them in there. Just like six pages or something. But if you know anything about this Tony Hawk, let me know because I don't really know a lot about it. I know people are asking like stupid amounts on like eBay and stuff, but if you know like a realistic like price on it, 
definitely comment down below. So, yeah, I think that's gonna wrap it up for this video. First little video back. I don't know. Next time I'm gonna post, probably a little, um, probably a little whatnot, like opening or something. So, try to post in a few days. So, be looking out. Make sure to like and subscribe.